Welcome back to Air Engine Research. Uh, today I'm going to be spending my time on an adapter that I had made for going on my turning lathe. I have a, a three or a four inch chuck and I bought a five inch chuck that I need in order to turn this ring down and clean it up. The one that I had before it just fit right over the top of it, so I couldn't use it. So hopefully this new adapter that I asked my friend to make for me will work. And today is what I'm going to be attempting to put it on and get it working. There seems to be a problem with the five chuck or the five inch one that the, the bolt holes around the outside, they're so close that the bolts won't go in straight. And I'm afraid they'll be hitting the this part of the chuck here whenever I installed it on the mill. I, I won't know until I actually try doing it. But let's hope that it's not going to be a problem. I need to turn the outside down of this one and also on the inside because the pipe that I used for making this was flash cut on the inside and it's a little undercut. So clean it up this goes on, gets welded to it. And that goes inside of this piston. And that's what will be driving the, the drive shaft rotator whenever it's attached. So for that, for now, let's go ahead and start on trying to get that. I got to take this adapter off. No easy way to do it. You just gotta. Is that one I used to have? It was a bigger mill, and I couldn't couldn't keep it because I don't have enough room here to do that. So I know that fits.
make sure it's gone. Still hitting. Darn. Okay, it appears now that I've got it turned down enough to be able to put the play on it and put that on. So I'm going to go ahead and put these in. about mountain the other part on there. A little bit more trouble than I thought it was going to be, but I guess that's the way life goes sometimes. Allen wrench. Next size up. Yep. Better start them all before I finish tightening up one. Just in case there's a little slack in it. like it's going to work.
then I have to make the head of the bolts three-eighths on the outside and I had to turn down the plate, I'm not sure, I never actually kept track. I just I guess it was about 90,000. about putting a ring on there. And it's self-centering, so... jaws are reversible so when I want to work on the inside I take these out turn them around and then they clamp on the outside and I can nail off the inside for now I'll just do the outside well I think that's going to be it for today I just wanted to show you that I got the uh, adapter plate today and I got it put on finally and it's going to work okay for what I'm doing so if you're interested in uh, watching what I'm doing and get notice on the videos each time when I have a new one put out if you want to subscribe I'd appreciate it Ooh, quarter after five already